What's going on guys? Welcome back to another Jang Zoe YouTube video. Now, I didn't think I had an avenue to upgrade the grind squad, but we did. But before we open the pack that we got, can you guys please hit the thumbs up button, hit the subscribe button, help me get to a thousand subscribers. But yeah, we did get a pack. Now I'm going to show you how we did it. Uh, we played salary cap. So as you can see here in salary cap, if you go all the way back here, this is right at the start. Uh, for getting up to whatever, I can't remember what level this one was, but you got a shattered prize piece. Then uh, you had another one here and I had already had one from salary cap previously. So that gave us a free hidden gems pack and we got it. We're ready to go. The next reward is uh, a barbecue bucket deluxe pack. Obviously, we don't need to get there. I might do it just for the fun of it, but who knows? Uh, it was a bit of a grind getting to this fight. And as you can see, my record took a hit because I played so many games today. I mean, it wasn't super, super crazy, but it was like, you know, I think I probably played about 14 games today. And I think my record was pretty bad overall. Um, obviously, 9 and 16 is pretty bad, but it is what it is. We have a way to upgrade the team. And that way is with a hidden gems 92 plus overall pack so we also have this hidden gems one here but um we're gonna well, we'll do both of them but we'll, this is the main one but um yeah let's have a quick look at the team see where we're sitting see where we're stacking up so the team's looking pretty good the team is looking pretty good uh i personally would like a backup power forward or center or maybe even one that can move Alex English down to the uh, backup position and be a starting power forward um, or a starting center and have Cap move across, either or. Um, so that's sort of what we're looking for out of this pack. Don't know how lucky we'll get, but uh, yeah. For the power forward that we want, we want someone that can shoot, rebound, and block shots. Uh, and, you know, there's not a lot that can do that, but... We'll see. We'll see who's out there. Let's go and have a quick look over here at, uh, where is it? My collection. Hidden gems. Diamonds. So we do have a few already, but uh, the diamond that we want is probably a power forward. Like I was just saying. So Boris Diaw might be might be a person. I don't know. He's only 6'8", so he's small. Same as Alex English. Uh, he does have a 93 ball, though. Um, who else do we have here in the way of power forwards? We don't really want Kwame Brown. Kwame Brown, because he yeah, only 79 three ball, not going to cut it. Although he is, uh, he is 6'11", so he's very tall. Same as a Mecha Okafor, probably not going to cut it. No, only a 43 ball. Uh, he is 6'10". Who else do we have here? Jack Sigma, he only plays center. Antonio McDice won't cut it. Horace Grant, I've seen, but he probably doesn't have a good three ball either. Yeah, 56. We really, I mean, I wouldn't mind a Bruce Bowen as, as, a, as a small forward. I wouldn't mind a Bruce Bowen. Rui Hachimura, Hachimura I know he's only 6'8 as well. Uh, but he does have an 89 three ball, and he, he's a decent player in general. So um, Rui would fit the mold. Uh, who else is here? Jalen Williams for OKC. What's he? 6'5. Oh, no, we're not getting 6'5 power forward. No way. Uh, that's way too small. Danilo Gallinari, I think, might do the job. 6'10", 93 three ball. What's his rebounding like? And his block. Only 75 block. And, yeah, not great rebounding. But he is 6'11". He is huge. Um, who else do we have here? Schrempf. Jonathan Isaac. Can Jonathan Isaac shoot? 86. He can shoot. So Jonathan Isaac would be clutch right there. Um, that would definitely be somebody I'm looking for. Just having a quick little scan. I'm not looking at everybody fully, like, crazily. Um, nobody else really there. Maybe Tom Gugliata. But once again, 6'10", 86 three ball. But rebounding probably going to be a problem. I oh, know 85 uh, and 88 rebounding, not bad. 88 block, actually way better than I expected. David West... Tobias Harris might be okay. I'm just having a little look around here, see who else is available. But yeah, there's a lot here that we could potentially get. Uh, but yeah, you just never know. Actually, that is who I want. I know he can't shoot, 
uh, 35 three ball, but I would run a point guard Ben Simmons any day of the week, uh, even at um, even though he can't shoot. But I definitely run him at point guard. Having a Ben Simmons at point guard will be epic at this time of year when not many people have gigantic point guards. Uh, but anyway, let's get over to the pack and let's rip it and see what we get. All right, pack market. Here we are. Unopened packs. We'll do our hidden gem first, just that normal hidden gem. This is like, I think, an 82. 82 plus. And we get a Sapphire. Tony Parker, TP. I don't think we have you yet. No, we don't, but welcome to Tim. Okay, here we go. 92 plus overall hidden gem. We haven't done a hidden gem in a while, so this will be cool. Uh, let's see who we get. Once again, we're looking for a power forward, preferably, but we'll see what happens. There's our diamond glow. Let the lightning go around. Let's flip the bad boy. And as always, we're going to try and guess who we get. So let's see here. Um, Eastern Conference, 95. Okay, so it is a big big guy. A Senna. Is that Rick Smith's? Roy Hibbert. Okay, not the player that I was looking for. A Senna only Roy Hibbert. I feel like we've got a lot of Senna's right now, but maybe. I mean, he is gigantic. He is gi what is Roy Hibbert, actually? Let's go and have a look at him. Let's uh, put him in the lineup and let's see what he does. Okay, so he's going to take uh, this spot here from Udonis Haslam. Not that Haslam was really in the squad yet, but uh, Roy Hibbert right here. Let's um, move him up into the center position just for now, just see what he looks like. So yeah, center, he's 7'2", so he's a gigantic man. Um, he has a 73 ball, that's not crazy. It's not not usable. I mean, it's not really usable, but it's not as bad as I expected. Um, all his post stuff is really good. Obviously, he's got a really good th uh, mid range. Actually, I was going to say three ball, but really good mid range. Uh, it's 95 standing dunk, 80 driving dunk, 97 block. Wow, interior defense 97, 94 rebounding on both. Very slow though. Very very slow. 47 speed and 40 speed with ball with 49 agility very very slow probably not really going to make the team but let's go and have a shoot around with him and let's see uh, before we do that hall of fame badges rise up post lockdown box out beast brick wall paint prodigy post powerhouse and paint patroller and then nine gold and one silver pause it if you want to have a look set shot specialist silver okay we could add it add uh, gold or even hall of fame to that um, but let's go and have a shoot around with him. Let's see what he's got. I'm not thinking he's going to have much in the way of uh, hot zones. So we have here the training hub freestyle. That is the team we want to start take in the grind squad. Let's shoot around with our old mate Roy. We need to get him on the court first. Substitutions. Roy Hibbert. There we go. Okay. Hot zones. Yeah, pretty much inside and then elbow and a little elbow jumper here a little elbow position so his shot is very weird man i hate shooting with this invisible ball his shot is very weird it's kind of, it's slow but because he's 72 it's high um not a bad release it sort of releases pretty smoothly um all right what's his dunking ability like oh man he is so slow he is so slow look how that's me with full turbo going that is full turbo yeah this Roy Hibbert is probably not going to make the squad speed is just going to be a problem his speed but I mean gigantic player definitely a player that you would be able to use uh, if you didn't have anyone else at that position and yeah, he's he's huge. But um, yeah, let's try a three ball with him. Now I like to take one off the dribble here and then one off a catch and shoot. With a 73 ball, you, I sh probably should be able to hit one of these. Maybe need to get a little bit closer. Slightly, okay, so we hit one there, we greened it. That one's a little bit, low. okay, went in slightly late. So it is hittable, but yeah. Roy Hibbert, probably not making the team. He's uh, 
probably just a little bit of a liability speed wise i'll chuck him in for one or two games and see how he goes and then uh you yeah, make a determination after that but yeah um yeah well that's it for this video guys uh like i said at the start if you haven't already hit the thumbs up button hit the subscribe button and um help me get to a thousand subscribers and um hopefully we will be able to add to the team tomorrow with julius randall on the park uh, you get five wins with julius randall and um you he gets added to your team so that will be a way we will be doing that tomorrow and uh trying to get julius randall but anyway for roy hibbert nah probably not going to cut it but anyway thank you guys for watching and uh stay tuned for the next one peace